Hello, Critter Protectors, Mr. Jim here, and welcome to Kids Animal Stories, a place where there's always a mystery and adventure around every single corner. If you love critters of all shapes and sizes, I need you on our Critter Protector team. Join our adventure as we learn about critters from around the world and in our backyards. Well, my friends, are you ready for today's adventure? Me too! Let's go! As the jackals started to drop the scorpions in one by one, this was serious. These were really dangerous scorpions. Do you know what a scorpion looks like? Yeah, he's got pinchers kind of like a crab and a very strange long stinger at the end of his tail. He's a little scary looking and they can be really, really dangerous. And the jackals knew that. All right, guys, this is our time. I'm going to wait here at the entrance. And after you drop in all the scorpions, <laughs> all the meerkats will be forced out right into my teeth. Ow, ow, ow. But I need a report, said Julius. Uh, Do we get all the scorpions in there? Oh, hey, boss. Yes, uh, we did get all of the scorpions in, and now we're just waiting. They were a little pokey. We it took Sorry, it took a little while, but uh, uh, those scorpions, you know, we don't want to get stung, so we just ha- it took a little time. All right, I, I don't care about all that. I just care that all the scorpions are inside. Guys, I think this plan is actually going to work. <laughs> As Malachi and Misha were gathering... All the meerkats together in a safe place. They had to make sure that everyone was accounted for. All right, uh, everyone count off. We should have 25 adults. Uh, go. One, two, three, four, five. The meerkats started counting off all the way to 25. Have you ever done that like at school or with a group of other kids? Yeah, sometimes we'll count off so that we know if everyone's there. That's exactly what Misha and Malachi were doing. 22, 23, 24, 25. Great. All right. We, it looks like we have everyone. Now we just have to wait and see what uh, those jackals are up to. As all of the grown-up meerkats were all huddled together in this one room of their maze of tunnels, one of them got very startled. <coughs> What's going on? shouted Misha. Who's over there? What's wrong? Misha and everyone scurried around as there was absolute panic. Nobody knew what was going on. Somebody was screaming and... Wait, it's Wanda. Wanda, are you okay? said Misha. Yes, but what is that? It just poked me with its pinchers on my tail. All the meerkats turned around and looked at the ground. Scorpions! Instantly, the meerkat started running in absolute panic. Wouldn't you be absolutely panicked if your bedroom was full of scorpions? <laughs> Me too. Well, as they were screaming, the baby pup meerkat started crying as well. And it was absolute pandemonium. Up at the top of the surface, the jackals were hearing all this commotion. <laughs> Sounds like our plan is working perfectly. They're terrified right now, and it will force them out because they won't want to get stung by those deadly scorpions. They have no option but to run right into our teeth. All right, jackals, get ready. Wait, hold on, everybody, shouted Malachi at the top of his lungs. Everyone, wait. Remember, scorpions aren't poisonous to us. Hold on! Wait, what did Malachi just shout? Oh yeah, I totally forgot. Meerkats are immune to the venom of scorpions. Wow, that is an amazing superpower. I think they're still a little creeped out by scorpions and their creepy crawlies, but the venom, the poison that is in scorpions' tails, it doesn't hurt meerkats at all. 
As all the meerkats started to calm down, Misha ran over to one of the scorpions. Uh, hello, uh, Mr. Scorpion, said Misha. How did you guys get here? Oh, hello. Well, you see, those very mean jackals, they grabbed us and they, they pushed us down your tunnel holes. And we're very sorry to scare you. We didn't mean it. The jackals, they, they, they made us do this. And we're very sorry. Oh, my goodness. The jackals were mean to you, too? Yeah. Oh, my. Well, we can be friends, said Misha. Meanwhile, up at the surface, the jackals were getting very antsy. When do you think all those meerkats are going to jump into our teeth like you said, boss? Said one of the jackals. Oh, my goodness. Wait a second. All their screaming has stopped. What's going on down there? It sounds like they started their party again. What? How is that possible? And it's actually true. The celebration that the meerkats had started when they had all those pups, they now just invited their new scorpion friends into the party. So they turned up the music and let the party bounce. And up at the surface, the jackals were very upset. Uh, boss, so does this mean we're not eating tonight? Ugh, guys. Let's get out of here. Maybe we can go eat some dead fish. Dead fish again, boss? Not another word. As the jackals ran off, Malachi, Misha, and the rest of the meerkat clan were now able to continue celebrating and having a great time with their new friends, the scorpions. The scorpions actually didn't have many friends, and so this friendship was probably never supposed to happen in the first place. But considering the situation, I think the meerkats and the scorpions might get along pretty well down there. Now that they're safe from those mean jackals. The end. It's time for some Critter Protector shoutouts. I want to say hey to Hunt and Rigdon from Oklahoma. Lexi from Sand... So not San Diego, South Dakota, <laughs> Desmond from Virginia, and Harvey from Canada, Connor from California, and Wilder from Montana. I'm so glad that you're all critter protectors. We need your help to save all the critters in the world and in our backyards. We couldn't do it without you, my friends. Well, you have a super duper day, and I'll see you next time. Bye!